ratio of two complement, the complements of two angle is 3 to 2 and the ratio of the supplements is 9 to 8. So find the two angles. Let's say uh, the angles are al theta and alpha. Or let's call it alpha and beta. So the ratio of their complement, what is their complement? Complement means we subtract the angles from 90. So 90 minus alpha and 90 minus beta are their complements. And what are their supplements? So supplements is going to be uh, 180 minus alpha and 180 minus beta. These are their supplements. Uh, so now we are given that the ratio of their complements this means that 90 minus alpha is 290 minus beta is 3 over 2 and let's cross multiply. So we have 180 minus 2 alpha is 90 times 3 is 270, 270 minus 3 beta and if we rearrange this, uh, add 3 beta over on both the sides and subtract 180 over on both the sides, this is what we get and let's call it equation 1. Likewise, we are given the ratio of their supplements is 9 is to 8. So if the ratio of their supplements is 9 is to 8, uh, what are their supplements? Uh, 180 minus alpha over 180 minus beta is 9 is to 8. Uh, let's cross multiply this and see what we are getting. 18 times 8, interesting, because if we cross multiply, 8 is going to be multiplied with 180 as well as alpha. So that's going to be 1440 minus 8 alpha is going to be equal to uh, 180 times 9 which is 1620 and this will be minus 9 beta so if we add 9 beta both sides and subtract 1440 both sides uh, 1440 both sides so this is going to be 180 over here and let's call it equation 2 so from equation 1 and equation 2 uh, we are going to find the value of alpha and beta so what we are going to do is uh, we're going to use elimination method in which I'm going to multiply equation 1 by minus 2, sorry, minus 4. So if I do that, I will have minus 12 beta plus 8 alpha is minus 360. Let's call it equation 3. And equation 2 remains as it is, which is 9 beta minus 8 alpha is 180. Uh, this is equation 2 already. So if we add both now, we get rid of 8 alpha. So that is the reason why we multiply it by minus 4. So we get rid of 8, 8 alpha and minus 8 alpha, we get rid of alpha. So because 8 alpha minus 8 alpha cancels out and we have minus 12 beta plus 9 beta is minus 3 beta. And this is equal to minus 180. And this value will come out as minus 180. And this value will come out as we divide both sides by minus 3, beta comes out as 60 degree. And if beta is 60, then from equation 1, from equation 1, uh, 3 times beta, which is 60, minus 2 alpha is 90, which means that 180 minus 2 alpha is 90. If we add 2 alpha both sides and subtract 90 both sides, that's how it's going to look. And we'll have 90 is equal to 2 alpha. And if we divide both sides by 2 and swap the equation, then alpha is nothing but 45 degrees. So this is the uh, value of alpha as well as beta as in these other two angles.